Okay, so I like to start off just taking off the cover and making sure everything's all right. Everything that I left in the boat is still there. So next I'm going to show you how I lead my trapeze bungee. Uh, I like to bring it around the bow and then just slip it through the spinnaker sock bungee so it doesn't uh, slip off the bow. And then it'll just go straight to the other side and this provides for a lot of stretch and a nice clean system. The next step is to set your rig tension. This chart gives a good estimate for rig tension based on wind. Keep in mind that sea state will change the optimal setting. When it's choppy, you want the rig a little looser for more drive through the waves. When it's flat water, you can afford a tighter rig and flatter sails. In this case, I decide on 18. I then wind my turnbuckles down to 2.1 on their scale. Now simply tighten the boat breaker and pin the four stay into the middle hole. turning block and then to make it easier hold the mouse just tighten everything up get the chip sheet nice and tight so it's out of your way it goes up here to this pulley system and this is what pulls the valve sprit out goes through this block and then directly back under the thwart through the cleat over this bungee here which keeps it from cleating when you're dousing through the block make sure it's under your, all your sheets it goes back here to this retrieval bungee and then just grab a spare tiller extension, tie the retrieval line around it, and push it up through the spinnaker bag. Okay, so I like to get my halyard, and then you go to where it's red and green, take a loop through, pull out, and then it's nice like that. Then run the green tape, make sure it's not twisted. Spin sheets here, which needs to be around four stay. And there's just a simple bowling onto the through the eye here. Okay. And last step is the retrieval line. And the key here is that it's on the port side of the boat and it goes under everything. So under the spinnaker. Eye. And grab it from the other side. Run your tape, make sure it's all straight. Run through the second eye, tie a big fat barrel knot. There you go, and then always check it. Okay, the key here is the umbilical cord. See the line goes under. The sheets are inside everything. 